all for your service and I yield back to the chairman. Thanks, Senator Whitehouse. Senator Grassley. Mr. Fonzone, uh, you can't have meaningful discussions about reauthorizing 702 when government reports and court opinions are heavily redacted and hidden from the public. Will you commit to declassifying information about the FISA abuses and procedures before the 702 reauthorization deadline? And if you can't say yes to that, why not? Yes, Senator, thank you. I think we, we have recently re released a FISC opinion and that released that declassified and um, a bunch of information. And the law already requires us to review FISC opinions for for classification and release them to the public. And we're committed to making more information public about se Section 702 to assist Congress and, and the public in its consideration of renewing this authority. Mr. Olson, I heard you say in your opening uh, statement about processes you're taking to make sure that uh, people that uh, are abused are, uh, or uh, people that abuse this process are going to be uh, held accountable. Uh, you heard about the 278,000 times that it was violated. What is the Justice Department doing to punish folks who have already abused FISA? Senator, thank you for that question. And again, compliance uh, it are, includes rules and procedures, but it only works if you have accountability. Um, and that's why the FBI has instituted a comprehensive approach to accountability for the agents and analysts who use FISA but abuse the rules. Um, it's on a spectrum for intentional misuse. Agents and analysts can be fired. In fact, one person was fired for wrongfully uh, violating the rules intentionally with respect to FISA. But the vast majority of the mistakes we've seen are not intentional, and the FBI has announced today, Deputy Director Bate talked about a three strikes approach of escalating penalties that include notes in a personnel file, loss of access to FISA data, um, and, and other measures, to including retraining, to ensure that uh, individuals are tracked over time if they're repeat offenders. Uh, so uh, there's, a, again, a range of, of, of repercussions in discipline, and I, and, and I know the deputy director and the director of the FBI take this very seriously. Okay. Mr. 